Good morning and welcome back to the vlog. It is Tuesday and um, it snowed this morning. <laughs> I like I woke up and I could hear what sounded like rain and I like kind of opened my curtains and but my blinds were still closed. I'm like, wow, it's really bright out there for raining. This is really weird. I was like, whatever. And I went to the bathroom and my friend texted me because we we're supposed to go for a walk today and he was like, so snow, huh? And I was like, wait, what? <laughs> and so I came back in and yeah, it did snow a little bit. And so I think what I could hear was the snow melting because it didn't snow that much and also it's sunny. But yeah, it was really confusing to just wake up and snow. <laughs> so yeah, anyways, good morning. <laughs> It's the start of my day. It is currently about 10 to 10. I just woke up very recently. Um, I had some weird dreams again last night. Can't really remember them, except there was one where they like built this condo or, or um, hotel on like a rock outcropping in the ocean and so it like went like this and like this this was like the ocean and then on this side there was like a pool built in the rocky outcropping but there were like wolves and bears and stuff and I'm like this doesn't seem like a good idea um there were other weird dreams but that's the only one that comes to mind right now yeah anyways plans for the day going for a walk with my friend then going to work <laughs> working coming home editing yesterday's vlog and I think that's probably about as much as we're going to manage to get done today because my shift starts at 2 30 and I think I'm scheduled to 7 30. I don't think I'm gonna have to work till 7 30 but I might. So anyways I need to start getting moving, getting myself going. I'll probably just have a breakfast drink quickly because I plan on grabbing food before I go to work um, but just something to keep me held over. <laughs> slash I slept in and I don't really have time to cook cook because uh, I also need to pack my bag for work. I'll probably wear my boots so that I need to pack my runners for work because it's just I could wear my boots around work but because they have a bit of a heel it's a pain. Probably have to pack something to do because it's another one of those recording days where I don't have to work the entire time. Um, yeah so that's what I need to do. So I think first step is gonna go get a breakfast drink and then start sorting myself out. Also, like I know I showed these in the Wednesday vlog, but some of these masks are just so adorable. So I have Beauty and the Beast, this cat one with the flowers. This one I screwed up. <laughs> it's upside down. It's a bleh. floral, more floral, some generic Harry Potter and Stitch. So cute. I think this is like my favorite batch of masks I've made. The only one that I'm like that is the superpower one. Superhero sound punchy noises. <laughs> okay, I need to start moving. Alrighty, so it is now quarter to 11. I am mostly ready. I'm just finishing packing up my bag, which includes packing this, even though like I think there's gonna be a lot of people in the theater, so I don't know if I'll have a chance to vlog, but we'll bring it. <laughs> we will be optimistic. It's cool. Um, I just need to decide what pants to wear. I'm gonna wear sweatpants. <laughs> it's just which sweatpants to wear. Also like why put on any pants other than PJs if you can avoid it. But yeah so I'm just about finished packing things up. I've really been doing nothing here. It's very slow morning but it's fine and then um yeah away I will go here very shortly. I better hurry up because he always says the time and then he's usually a little bit early so I should probably shut up and throw this in the bag and um figure everything out. <laughs> It's just like what I 
told you so At glance you failed to turn away And found a reason for this pain Well I guess that's what it's worth Like a diamond when a curse If I told Alrighty, so pretty much everyone's left now except for the text. The last act is on the stage at the moment. So I've just kind of packed up everything, Boop. Um, or almost everything, and I'm gonna put on my sweater, I guess, and then get out of here, go home. I have to edit the vlog. Well, I just have to edit yesterday's portion of the vlog, get that exporting, get a thumbnail done, get that up. And, um, and then see how the night goes. But I did get a little bit of writing done and now I'm going over the details because the next step is to either type up all that stuff or work on the axe. And I think I'll probably work on the axe because that's more exciting. So yeah, we're making good progress, but I'm gonna finish packing everything up and I will see you at home. So it's 10 to eight. <laughs> I left work at like 5.30, which was nice because I only worked like three hours and got paid for four great um <laughs> I was allowed to leave <laughs> I'm not just cheating my job and then I came home and I was like okay I should edit the vlog portion from yesterday but the problem is is because now we're on three days so once I imported and rough cut everything and then I had to render it all like it it took a long time to render so I watched um Valky Ray streaming for a little bit on YouTube and then I went and I ate dinner and then I came back up and I was like okay I'm gonna start the vlog or I'm gonna pick up the camera when this finishes rendering which was like seven and then I was like okay I'll just edit a little bit and then I was like almost done editing it before I remembered that I wanted to pick up the camera so you're now caught up to what I was doing and um I'm just actually gonna work on the thumbnail right now I've been trying new thumbnails and I don't I'm I don't know my <laughs> my photoshop skills aren't the best they're adequate um but they could be better so I guess they're gonna either get better or just stay the same during this but that's okay also exciting and it could change because things fluctuate but in this exact moment I have 250 subscribers on YouTube which is so exciting ah! I like see people that are like oh my god I hit 8 million I'm like oh my god I'm almost at 250 which is like really exciting honestly every subscriber I'm like so jazzed so hey hi thanks if you've subscribed, thanks. Hi. If you haven't subscribed, you should because it makes me excited. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to work on my thumbnail and then I think I'm just going to like finish unpacking my bag from work because I haven't really done that. Get myself sorted for tomorrow because I do have to work in the morning again tomorrow. So that's, that's where we're at, I think. I don't think I'm going to get anything productive done besides having done this vlog but I mean in good news I did get a fair amount of writing done and I was going through I, I feel like I mentioned it did I, I was going through my old notebook the one that I mentioned in the last vlog where <laughs> I was going through it and I was like oh my god I like planned a lot of this stuff already and it's actually super helpful so I've been going through and like highlighting and adding notes and then I will do -do -do -do, brain use my brain use my brain <laughs> And then I'll go through and I'll actually do my acts and everything, which I do mostly, at least minutely, have planned on my computer, which is exciting. But oh my god, this is getting really heavy for some reason, so I'm gonna go stop talking, do my work, and um, I'll check in with you before I go to sleep. Okay, so it's just about 10 o'clock now. Um, I've just kind of been puttering. Wow, tripping over words. I got my list set up for tomorrow because I need to film some video game videos because I have them coming up going up this week like Thursday but I don't next week so I'm gonna keep doing that I need to do that I also got my masks pinned over there so they are ready to do the sewing bits 
<laughs> I like the top stitching and the finishing touches. Um, and then I guess the next step probably won't be before the weekend, but I don't know, maybe depending on, no, probably not. <laughs> I do this all the time where I like have the conversation in my head while I'm talking out loud, but just give up the conversation out loud. Um, tomorrow, I if I'm finishing them, I won't have a chance to cut all the other masks that I have to do now. Did I mention it? That my boss asked me to make some masks with um, this pattern on it. I don't think I did. So my boss asked me to make masks with this pattern on it for all the teachers and tech workers for a the um kids spring camp that we're doing at the theater because it's like um oh my god my brain it's superhero themed and that was actually the mask as i mentioned that i was making for my co-worker because she wanted oh my god i i got ah i like couldn't think and also sort out the masks at the same time but in my brain i was like you must sort out the masks now you can't just leave them here <laughs> and so i was struggling anyways she had asked me to make a mask, the one that I cut upside down, and so I was talking to her about talking to her about it today, and I was like, oh, the scrunchie's done, I just need to sew it um, shut, but the masks, I gotta cut. And then my boss was there, and then we were talking about it, and he's like, oh, can you make some? So yeah, I have to make seven masks <laughs> now. Um, so I'm gonna try to get them done by next week, but I can't, if I'm finishing those tomorrow, I won't have time to cut, I don't think. Thursday, maybe in the morning. I do work a later shift that day, so maybe I can cut them in the morning, but then Friday, I still at this point believe I'm going puppy sitting and then I'll be gone all weekend. And so and then Monday will kind of be my next day back here doing stuff. But I've rambled, I feel, for a long time or not. I don't know. I'm losing it. I'm gonna go to sleep, I think. Well, I'm gonna climb to bed, probably watch another episode of New Amsterdam. It's like, it's enjoyable, but also not super realistic. But the one thing that I really do enjoy about it is unlike some of the other medical dramas and everything that you watch, it's not like people having sex every two seconds, which I approve. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna climb to bed and um, I will see you tomorrow back at the theater. <laughs> Good night. So over the last couple weeks, I've come to the conclusion that I either need to take a lot of time to repair this sweater, that's just one of the many issues, or I need to replace it. And I'm really sad about this, that because I've had this sweater for I think like 10 years or something, maybe more. <laughs> and especially over the last four years, it's kind of transitioned to my, this is the sweater I wear to work because it's just so oversized and cozy and like chill. But like over here too, you can see. It's, it's just struggling, so I'm, I'm sad about that. I'm, I'm, I'm in denial. Anyway, good morning and welcome back to the theater. It is Wednesday, I think. I'm fairly certain it's Wednesday. And um, just here to have a good time. <laughs> and this time, unlike usually when I'm here for a good time, but not a long time, I'm here for a good time and a long time. It's, um, I think it's gonna be like a seven hour shift. I think I'm gonna be here to like 3.30 today, which is like, it's been a long time since I've had a long shift like that, but we'll see. Anyways, here I am, and then after I get off work, I'm gonna try to do some filming, I think, because tick, 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 time is ticking down to get that done before I go away for the weekend, and otherwise I have to film and edit next Monday, which I'd prefer not to do. So yeah, that's where we're at. I am going to go for my breakfast drink, which is like whoop, right there. It's the best my pointing behind me has ever worked on camera. Um, watch a show probably, and then um, get this party started. <laughs> I don't even know. I don't even know. <laughs> so today, like 15 minutes before I was leaving for the end of the day at work, I found out that the weekend schedule changed um, three weeks ago, and nobody bothered to tell me, which is a big problem. <laughs> because when I looked at my schedule last week, not only did they not tell me, they didn't change my schedule. When I worked at my schedule last week, when I was asked to puppy sit this weekend, I looked and I was like, oh, I work Friday morning, but then I don't work past noon. I don't work Saturday. I don't work Sunday. Then a show got added on. And so they're like, okay, there's, there's a shift Saturday afternoon. I'm like, okay, that works. Cause it's, it's just a short one. It should be fine. And then today, as I was leaving, I go, okay, I'll see you tomorrow afternoon because I'm not in early. And they're like, oh no, that's not Thursday anymore, that's Friday now. And I'm like, wait, what? And I'm like, oh, this must have just changed. So I go down and find my boss, find out it changed. Like I said, like three weeks ago, 
I would not have agreed to puppy sit this weekend if I knew I had two and then three shifts. So like now I have to work. So initially I was going to work tomorrow night. I was going to work Friday morning and then I was off all weekend. And then it was going to be tomorrow night, Friday morning, and a little shift Saturday afternoon. But now instead it's Thursday morning, probably not th Friday morning, Friday afternoon, Saturday morning and Saturday afternoon. So I am not jazzed about things if we're being fully honest. Like I know that the schedule is changing pretty rapidly and pretty regularly, but I have had multiple conversations with multiple people about Thursday, even so recently as like Tuesday and Monday. <laughs> so that's fun. I got to figure out how to make that work. It's not, it's because I'm with the puppies and they have specific needs and stuff. And also they're senior. They can't stay home alone for a long period of time by themselves. So I think it's going to be a struggle. If it was just like, if I wasn't puppy sitting this weekend, it wouldn't be a problem. And tomorrow I might find out that I don't need to puppy sit this weekend. Uh, but we'll see. Anyways, I'm home now. It is 25 after four. I'm feeling really blah. I've had some really bad like back and shoulder pain for the last couple days and I think it's because of my boobs. Um, because they're ridiculous and I, COVID weight gain has gone particularly to the chestal region here and um, I'm not a fan of it to be honest. So I need to make that stop <laughs> basically. But I don't need to film today now I guess which is great because I am not in the mood to film. Maybe I'd be in the mood to film if I didn't have that wonderful situation just before I got off work. Um, so I think I'm going to try to do as little as possible today because I'm just not vibing it. <laughs> I'm just not in the mood to do much. Ideally, I would love to sew my masks just because then I'd be excited to have more masks. But truly, I'm just, uh, and I have a bit of a sore throat. And because of COVID, I'm like, oh my God, do I have COVID? Also, like we were down to like single digit cases um, in the like regional health district that I'm in. We had like four or five days with no community transference. And then there was an outbreak at a bunch of high schools and we're up to 42 cases, which I know is low compared to a lot of people, but or a lot of places, but here it's kind of high. And um, so every time now that I'm like feeling a little bit off, I'm like, uh oh. So yeah, anyways, my throat's sore, but it could just be from a lot of talking lately. So I'll just get me some sepical and uh, oh, sepical and uh, hope that makes a difference. And then I'm just gonna maybe transfer some footage and chill for a bit. And then I'm just kind of see where the day goes, but yeah, not impressed. Three weeks, three weeks. Remember when I said yesterday wasn't it? Well, it super wasn't it. <laughs> I um, probably filmed that clip <laughs> and then I was like, I don't feel like doing this anymore, like being awake. <laughs> and so I climbed to bed at like 5.30. I watched like three episodes of New Amsterdam. I think I got out of bed at about 8.30 to just go to the bathroom, get ready for, finish getting ready for bed. And then I fell asleep like 20 minutes later and I slept pretty much straight through until 7.20 this morning. So I got almost 10 hours of sleep, which I think was desperately needed, but also like did nothing yesterday. And also I probably could have slept for longer. My lower back hurts a bit from staying in my bed for so many hours, but I do feel a lot better than I did yesterday. Like yesterday I was just, I was tired, I was sore, I was grumpy. And it just, it wasn't it. So anyways, we're back. It is, what day is it? Thursday? It is Thursday. <laughs> and um, I have a short shift at the theater. I was supposed to work tonight, late, well, like one o'clock, but I'm here at eight because of all the things that changed yesterday that apparently changed three weeks ago that nobody told me about. Love it. And Saturday I'm good for. But Friday, I still have to figure out the logistics of being able to come in for that shift. They said that they'll be fine if I can't, um, but we'll see. Anyways, and also today I find out if um, da, 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 if I actually for sure have to puppy sit or not. So if I don't have to puppy sit, then all the stress was for nothing and I can easily figure out Friday. Like I can just come in earlier, but because of puppies, I can't leave them alone for that long. Anyways. 
I'm gonna go have a breakfast drink, wake, finish waking up, because after that coma, waking up is necessary. I was having weird dreams, for sure. There was, like, Iron Man was there, but not Iron Man. And um, Chewbacca was there, and some other guy. And there was, like, a war. It was weird. Anyways, I'm gonna go, and I will see you, hopefully, a little bit more today than yesterday. <laughs> well, hello, I have arrived home. I've been home for a while, actually, to be honest. It is currently three o'clock, and I just reached out to Jessica's mom to see if we're still a go for this weekend. I mean, it'd be kind of nice if we weren't because then it would relieve a lot of stress on my part, um, but we'll see. I have deconstructed the desk here because I'm gonna film in a bit here. This is like, the sun is just in the absolute worst place right now. I'm, I'm gonna film in a bit here and then um, I think I'm gonna finish sewing my masks. That is the plan for today. I'm also currently doing laundry, so I'm just waiting for that to be done. I think it's like another 15 minutes. Lighting is terrible. And um, yeah, that's where we're at. And I think I'm going to try to get something together to embroider this weekend, assuming I go to the pups, because it'll just be something mindless that I can do while I watch the TV, because I don't think I have too much to do. Oh, and I should probably also edit vlog footage today. Okay, we got lots to do, so I should probably stop being lazy, but honestly, I've just been listening to Lord of the Rings and hitting my mic with my headphones apparently. It's fine. Alrighty, so I filmed one video and then I decided I just wasn't in the mood to film another one, so I'm not going to. So I got my sewing machine out now and we're gonna work on this stack of masks, which are like 50% for me, but that is totally fine. Um, and I'm watching Bondi Rescue because they're uploading full episodes onto their YouTube channel, which is exciting. Seriously, it was like my June quarantine binge situation, so I suggest it. Um, but yeah, and then I remembered I have to do invoicing today too, so I have lots of stuff to do and I have to pack. It is a go for, for puppy sitting, so I need to figure out my logistics for Friday. Yeah, that's where we're at. Anyways, um, I've just got my thread all out because I gotta pick the colors of all these guys and, uh, and uh, we're just gonna get through it. My throat and chest are making weird noises, but we're gonna survive. Also, my laundry's done, which is exciting, so I just need to power through. I think I just, I, there's lots to do. I just need to do lots. <laughs> Okay, so it's like 8.30 and I'm not really sure how that happened. It's fine. Um, finished dinner like an hour ago and then was just chatting. It was just my mom's boyfriend and I today because she is at work. But as you saw, I finished my masks and I'm just, I think this one, I don't know, it's so hard. Like I love this one with the really grumpy cat in the garden. But like this Harry Potter one is just so simple. And then Stitch is like 100% my favorite Disney character ever. So that's fun. And then Beauty and the Beast, Belle was like my favorite princess, but now I really like Elsa, but technically she's a queen. So anyways, love these. The other ones I made, I am sending to a friend. So that's exciting, but I still have so many things to do. I just, okay. So to break it down, I should probably fold my laundry, put it away, and I need to pack for the weekend. Step one. Step two, I mean, not necessarily this order. I need to invoice today. I was going to do it yesterday. That was my plan on Sunday, but changed my mind because I just died yesterday. It was fine. And number three, I should probably edit the vlog from like yesterday and the day before. Yesterday is like two clips, so it's fine. But like the day before, uh, there was GoPro footage and others. So I think what I'm probably going to do is put that back over there. <laughs> 
ignore that for now, but grab my mouse pad and my keyboard and reset the desk. I guess I can take these. I just, oh, I love them. I'm so excited about these ones. These are like the first ones I feel that I'm like super jazzed about. I do really actually, you know what, but seagulls. And like, I love this one. I don't think I ever showed it when I was making it. Can I do this one handed? The wire popped through right here. And so it stabs me. But yeah, I, as you can see, this is my scrunchie and mask situation. Cool. And then I've got my dirty ones up there, which I need to remember to clean. And oh, can I find? This is my trail scrunchie that I was wearing the other day. But as you can see, we have a blow in seam here. It was practice. I think it needs to be a little fuller too. So that's fine. Okay. But was I, <laughs> was there brain power going on? Oh, I, I've been listening to Lord of the Rings. So I want to do embroider the Argonauts. Um, but we struggling. I ordered some carbon paper today to make transfer easier because we struggling. But yeah, I'm going to spend a little bit of time tidying up, getting myself ready to go. I'll probably do invoicing first because hopefully it'll go quickly. <laughs> Famous last words. I should probably also shower today. Oh, I just have a lot of things to do and doing nothing yesterday was really unhelpful. Yeah, I've got a couple things I can do today, looks like. Okay, there's not a ton of invoicing, so it shouldn't take me too long, because most of the invoicing is still continuing on through Friday or Saturday. Okay, I've rambled enough. I'm going to clean and then hopefully be productive. Been losing all momentum but Just because it's easy But that don't make it better Well, it is currently just about 11. I got my invoicing done. I got the vlog edited up until like, I guess all the, wow, wow. Two days. I got two days done out of the three. I still have to do today's. Oh, that was bad. That was real bad. Um, I've got all my fold it clothes. Oh my God. Why is my brain doing backwards? I've got all my clothes folded over there and, um, I still need to pack, but I might just toss the majority of that into like the hamper or something for the night and pack in the morning. I, I don't know what time I'm getting picked up yet because uh, I said, oh, I don't work tomorrow. So like you can pick me up at home whenever and I got no response. So I'm still going to assume it's probably going to be sometime around noon, but maybe I'll wake up at like 930 so I can pack and be chill and get all that stuff done. I don't know. Anyways, I got most things done on my list today. I did film earlier, I think I mentioned, but I don't know. I was just like talking about my mental state or mental health state currently, and it feels like maybe it was a bit of a downer, so I don't know if I'm gonna use that or not. Anyways, we'll see, but I was gonna shower today, but I'm too lazy now. I think I'm gonna go... I bought bagels today, and I really want a bagel. <laughs> so I think we go have a bagel and then probably climb into bed. So I'm just gonna end the vlog here. Thank you so much for coming along on the adventure over the last couple days. It was roller coasters. Like, like honestly, the two, I only had two clips from yesterday and the two clips were like whiplash. Like I was so jazzed and excited in the morning. And then when I picked up the camera in the afternoon, I was like, everything sucks, <laughs> which is just really funny. It's fine now. I mean, I'm still mad about it. Three weeks, <laughs> but it's fine. I will get through this week and then hopefully things will be better. I told my boss, I'm just going to ask every day, has anything changed? Has anything changed? Has anything changed? And that way, in case I don't ask and something does change, they'll be like, God, Tiffany was so annoying. And they'll tell me. So anyways, that's the plan going forward. <laughs> it's a bad plan, but that's it. I'm going to go now. Please subscribe if you're not subscribed, if you got to the end of this video. And I will see you on Wednesday for the next vlog. Good night. Mm -hmm.